changes. In 1776, this great nation accepted that armed conflict was the only way to preserve our rights to life, liberty, and the pursuit of happiness. If our founding fathers could only see us now. From Antietam to Amiens, Okinawa to Anchorage, we have fought. And now, the red menace is at our doorstep. Democracy itself is under threat of annihilation. That is why today, July 4th, 2076, 300 years after our great nation began, we gather together to honor the completion of Vault 76. This sprawling underground shelter may have been engineered by Vault Tech, but it was built by you, the good people of America, so that if the bombs do come, if the end does come, our way of life will endure. But not everyone will be saved. Those chosen to enter this vault must be our best and our brightest. For when the fighting has stopped and the fallout has settled, you must rebuild. Not just walls, not just buildings, but hearts and minds, and ultimately, America itself. So as we stand here today, we pray that the world will know peace. But if that is not our destiny, if war must come, we stand together knowing that here in Vault 76, our future begins. with nothing less than the rebuilding of America. Such a huge responsibility. Just know that vault Tech is proud of you. I am proud of you. When you hear this, it means I've been gone for several hours. I've got my own mission out there in Appalachia. This is the Overseer, signing off. Message repeats in 24 hours. That's right, System sir. System Be on constant alert for the clickety-click of your pip boys built-in radiation meter. No creature comforts out there, sir. You want it? You do <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 
of a party last night, eh, sir? Good to see you all together one last time. Rebuilding America! Glad I'm staying here. <laughs> Still, I'm sure your camp will make it easy peasy. Overseer's log, or should I say, direct communication. Because whoever is listening to this had the moxie to try to find out where I've gone. But I'm glad you did. Truth is, I need your help. I've been given a task and I've decided to break protocol and tell you what it is. Sir, possess the skills necessary to accomplish anything. I'm sure of it. down there, they seem exceedingly alive. They haven't yet made any untoward advances, but perhaps you could speak to them? Verify their intentions are civil? Until quite recently, it's been exceedingly peaceful. I maintained my post, greeted latecomers out of the vault, and otherwise reveled in Appalachia's natural splendor. But very recently, it seems people have come back to Appalachia. Those two and more to boot. The non-vault sort, you understand. It's all very concerning. Who knows what they might be up to? Only that they have one seemed... Only that they one seemed only that they are one seemed quite perturbed. I've been keeping watch. I'm sorry. Well, yeah. Oh, do be Whoa, just a friend here, not a threat. Just had some questions for you. You came out of the vault, right? I thought it was empty. Wait, is the door still open? My partner and I need a way into that vault. 
We got a tip from the Wayward. Heard of the place? New bar down the road. So this guy told us that... After you gave him the last of our caps? And he said that inside that vault is the... You know, that's where the big one is. Our last chance to turn our lousy luck around. Wait, what? He's jerking you around, Lacey. Face it. We got scammed. But... Those were the last of our caps. No. Someone has to know something. We're just gonna stick it out until we find them. Wonderful. <laughs> Look, thanks for... whatever. Now, unless there was... something you needed... They didn't give you a weapon? I guess I've got something I could spare. Here. You certainly could, but since you decided to yank our chains, I'm gonna say no. About Appalachia? Other than it's a graveyard? There's that. We haven't been here real long. But from what we've been able to piece together, the area got hit pretty hard. Not long after, well, these things showed up. The scorched. They're merciless. They seem to have cleaned up whoever the bombs might have missed. Without people around, everything else has gone haywire. We both came over from Virginia. Well, what was Virginia? There's a lot more hot zones that way. And the few spots that are livable, well, they got picked clean fast. I mean, Appalachia's dangerous, really dangerous, but it's better than where we've been. Maybe I did. Or maybe you should ask the thing you've got trapped inside the vault. Mm-hmm. Bye. There's got to be a way in there. Maybe... Wait, a vault dweller? Hey there! Work making a living out here. Gotta keep a lookout for raiders. What the heck was that?
Lady, I will paint the wall. Honey, you picked the wrong time to get a drink. What are you? Hey! Who the hell are you? Like hell you are, bucko! I told you it was gonna end badly. Now I'm hoping you're here to have a drink and play nice. I've had a gun pointed at me more than enough for one day. Huh. Well, not exactly the introduction to the wayward I would have hoped for. Well, sorry about that, darling. First round's on me. Name's Duchess. There's something I could do for you. Your guess is as good as mine, sweetheart. He busted in here saying I needed to turn over the location of some fella named Crane, who I guess I must have served at some point or another. Since then, a steady stream of miscreants has been making my life irritating. Not exactly good for a budding business. Now that you mention it, I could use an extra pair of hands. See? That boy you put down. He's not the first of his crew to roll in here. But I want him to be the last. Normally, I'd send my people out to clean house. But my muscles run off, so I don't have the bodies to spare right now. But I'm willing to pay good money if you put an end to this for me. So, what do you say? That's what I was hoping. So, the details. Now, each of these boys came in asking after Crane. I'm thinking we can make that work for us. How would you grab the attention of a bunch of single-minded thugs? Oh, darling. Um, see, as fine as, you know, I was... Just give me one second. Uh, okay, I think I'll just... Uh, I just want you to know, architecture ain't exactly my forte. Huh, not half bad. So what I have chicken scratched together here for you is the schematic for one custom-made Crane Treasure Hunting Inc. sign. If I didn't butcher the plans too bad, it's got a little system built in that'll make sending out an advertisement and getting this gang's attention a snap. You just need to build. They did teach you all how to... That's the spirit. Hey, if you need a refresher, good old Morty Mort. What are you on about, Mordecai? Hey, nah, I'm not bragging. Oh, Mort, nothing. Well, you find your... Of course you're gonna need materials, but we should have enough lying around to cover you. Throw some rations in there, too. And so you know, you might have to break some of this scrap. Who knows? Now, you ready to get this show? Hot dog. Be Just make sure, once you find out where they're hiding, that their leader gets the message. The wayward. Oh, and it's a little out of date at this point. But it seems it might have been left for someone from her vault. Maybe it was waiting for you? Sounds like she set the camp up so her people could get some practice in self-reliance. Probably worth looking into if you think you could use a little refresher. Glad to hear, Vault Tech. You hear these rumors, right, about... 
Well, don't you worry. Now, what can I do for you? Allergies. Learn the hard way. I can't stand within 10 feet of a strawberry. <laughs> Come on, man. That's a joke. Truth is, I was outside on Doomsday. Now, you see, I drove security. And I was coming back from a pickup in the truck when I feel this rumble and then quiet. Then a whole lot less quiet. And the truck was hit with this wind. And it was like someone dropped a hurricane on it. I can hear it battering the truck. Bang, 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 like it's got a grudge against it. And then I unlock the door and into the back and then bang, I wake up, man. And it's crazy. Somehow, in the back of the truck, alive and kicking. And all it cost me was my skin and any opportunity for someone liking me for anything other than my lovely personality. And that... Allergies. <laughs> nice. And it was like someone dropped... Bang, I wake... No, it cost me. And that... I'm... Main one is that radio... All the meat. There's also... But ever since that... That I... Serious... Come Shit. I... Overall though... Allergies. Learn the heart... Look who it is. Question I can answer? Listen, friend. All right, listen. I got this plan. You're gonna help me get rich. See, the folks who made it big off the gold rush, they weren't the prospectors. They were the folks that sold them their shovels. Now, I don't do shovels. What I collect, I made these hollow. All I'm asking, You will? Oh, thank you. I'm... Now, there anything else you wanted to chat about? Allergies. Learn the hard way. I can't stand within ten feet.
Hello there, stranger. Where'd you come ambling in from? One of those vault dwellers, are you? I've heard tell of your kind. Solved a lot of problems. And caused a lot of problems from what I hear. You wouldn't happen to be one of the problem-solving kind, would you? I could use one of those right about now. Oh, excuse me. Let me introduce myself. Name's Lane Platt. I'm with the Responders. We're a band of self-titled do-gooders around these parts. Appalachia's filling up fast, and we're trying to keep everyone hale and healthy and off each other's throats. I like to think so. It gives me hope that we can one day right all the wrongs in this world. Now, there's a lot going on in this neck of the woods, more than I can tackle myself. You got ferocious beasts roaming the forest, creepy cult moving into the caves, and all manner of people about ready to go to war with one another. All that is to say, I could use a hand, and I'd be willing to pay you for yours. What do you think? Why, that is just terrific. Thank you a thousand times over. Uh, here's the job for today. A forest is a dangerous place. Not compared to other nations, mind you, but let's not lose sight of the facts. To make it safer for new settlements, we've been clearing out dangerous critters and using the meat to feed people in need. If you could go retrieve the meat from our traps, I will happily compensate you. I appreciate your help. Stay safe out there. Daddy won't stand a chance with you on the job.
You're back! You've recovered the meat from our traps. Just what I wanted to hear. On behalf of the responders, I can't thank you enough. You helped us make progress toward a more peaceful world. I sure wish I could say that's all the help I needed, but the work never ends. If you're in the neighborhood again sometime, I will always welcome more of your help. Day in the meantime, though, here's your payment. Have a good day now. Okay, Jack. Okay, John. 